Hey guys, so you may have noticed that this isn't my room. That I'm filming in a different room. Because this is such a special occasion today for me that I decided that I wanted to film in a different room. So, I'm really excited again because now I have Donatello. Leonardo, Michelangelo, and Raphael. But this is, if you haven't noticed yet, the 2003 style. So, let's look at the articulation. The articulation on these figures is the head can swivel. Both left and right. The swivels at the arm. And you can actually move their hands open, close, so they can grab their weapons. But you can also have, like, Donnie opening his hand for something. Like, if he's being handed something. And then, there's the shell, pretty nice paint job, but back to the articulation. Um, there's also swivels at the leg. No swivels here, but there's swivels at the knee, sorry, at the knee. And what's really cool is you can move their toes if you hold that down. Same on the other leg, you know, the toes. Oh, you can move at the um leg at this one. You can move at the knee on this one. Oh, yeah, you can. So, this is actually the better leg. I wonder what's blocking him on this leg. Oh, the shell. You see, the shell is blocking that leg. Let's take a look at the weapon. So, the one of the weapons is one of the main reasons I bought the 2003 Ninja Turtles. Because they have really good paint jobs. Look at that. Look at that. It's white in the middle. Has anyone ever seen a Donnie bow that's white in the middle? But for 2003, even now. Well, maybe I'm the classics, but like. I couldn't afford all the classics. So, I bought these guys off of eBay, because I found them on Amazon for like $237, and I didn't have enough for that, but I do have enough for the $35, the, 30, the $35 one, and then the $35 one was out of box, but it had all four Ninja Turtles in it. And I have to say, I'm pretty disappointed with the weapons. They don't really hold on to them very well. And, um... That was probably my least favorite done, because he doesn't hold on to his weapon very well. Now for Leo. Leo... Can hold on to his weapons pretty well, but not really. There's his katanas. There's Leo, the figure. So, let's, let's get these katanas out and look at the articulation on them. So, just like Donnie, swivels at the head, swivels at the arm. Swivels at the knee.
And again, show blocking the first leg, second leg. Oh, Leo show the big. Leo show blocks both legs. Let these, let's get these katana blades back in there. And then here's Raphael. Raphael is probably the one that holds his weapons the second best. And look at that. Oh, there's a stain on it from the last person. I better wash that. And now the articulation. You know what? I don't think I'm going to do the articulation anymore. It's pretty much the same for all the turtles, except for, you know, the shell blocking. Shell's blocking on that one, too. Let's move on to Michelangelo. Michelangelo is my all-time favorite turtle. He's my all-time favorite figure, too. But what saddens me is that Donnie is my second favorite Ninja Turtle. But he's, he just doesn't hold on to his weapon very well. I like all these turtles, except for the weapons. So, there you go. Michelangelo. You see, I'm wiggling his weapons, and I wiggle Donnie. That's why I wiggle Donnie. Look at this. His weapon fell out. Right there, there's his weapon. But if I wiggle Michelangelo... Then his nunchucks just... Do what I want them to do. So, yeah. So, I know this is going to probably make my video a little long. I don't really care. I'm going to talk about the first episode of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2003, in case no one's seen it yet. Now, it does play on Nicktoons, but... You know, if you people didn't know that, then... I'm going to talk about it. You. Okay, so, Turtles. First episode, 2003. Okay, so here's what happens. The Turtles are training in the lair. The turtles are training in their lair, and then the mousers, the mousers come in the first episode this time, the mousers bite through the walls of the lair, turtles, and then the turtles bite off the mousers, obviously, but the mousers destroyed the lair, so they have to go find a new lair, so they go up to the streets, they're gonna find a new lair. Now, the Foot Ninja come in. Oh, wait, no, sorry. Uh, they bite off more mousers in the sewers. Then they go up to the streets, bite off the purple dragons. Hun doesn't come in in this episode yet. Hun comes in, in, um... The first time they actually fight Hun is in the way of invisibility, but he comes in a different episode. I think it's Darkness in the Edge of Town. I don't know. So, Hun... Wait, no. The Purple Dragons, they fight the Purple Dragons. They go out. Then, then we come to the Foot Ninja. 
So they bite off the foot ninja. Then they go back into the layer. Then they find a new layer. And they find a new layer, so they move into that layer. And then this is like um, a story plot for like five episodes. So I'm just going to talk about the first one. If you liked what I was talking about, if you thought it was cool, go see the first Ninja Turtle series. So thanks for watching. Subscribe. Please subscribe, sorry.